Hi everybody, Linda here. Well, I'm doing a little mixed media. It's day before Easter and I haven't put anything outside my door and everybody has all these really cute little things outside their door. <laughs> and I haven't put any Easter things out there. So I thought I'd do a little canvas, a little mixed media canvas. And I took some tissue paper and put it on here and then some, these were some jelly prints that I had and then this is some of this tissue paper that I just shredded. And now I'm at the spot where I'm going to do some, um, oh, you know, outlining to make it, to make everything pop. And I thought that might be a better time to turn the camera on. Uh, it's a beautiful day. Well, it's like 70. Well, let me see what is the temperature. It's 74 outside, but it's very cloudy and kind of humid. I did go out for a bicycle ride earlier, and I got a new watch, and I forgot to put it, turn it on. Well, I thought I turned it on. I really want to try to see what I'm doing. Um, the bicycle is new because I'm in town now, and there's a lot of uh, streets that are... You know, nobody's on, <laughs> and so they're good to ride on, and um, I really like to find some good bike paths, but I'm really out of shape. So, I'm, I'm outlining this, but I really don't want it to be perfect. I want, you know, to be kind of squiggly lines. And this bunny, basic shape bunny, I found on Pinterest... I pinned it, and, um, you know, it was supposed to be zen-tangled, so I thought that was kind of cool, the way they zen-tangled it. So now I'm just putting some lines in here. I guess my gesso is not completely dry, but that's okay. So, and then this I want it to come down like this. Again, this was um, some paper that I made with my jelly print. And I need to use this stuff up. This is just a Sharpie that I'm using. It seems to be working pretty good. So I want to make these look more like flowers. I keep trying to um, record the seagulls. Here I am in Wisconsin on the Wisconsin River and there's these amazing huge seagulls outside the window because I'm on the river. And um, it's it's so cool to see them, but well, all my windows have screens on it, and so it makes it a little bit hard to do the picture. All right, so now the eyes really aren't dry yet, but. So I have a couple of different pieces of paper here. There's eyes. And then this, I took some like gold watercolor, but then I thought, well, this is supposed to be mixed media. So I took some gold uh, embossing powder, but it really wasn't melting very good on top of the gold watercolor. So, you know, when I got it all heated up and dry, I took this gold brilliance um, ink pad and just went over it, and that turned out pretty good. So now I think I want this to come down like this. Come down like this. And I think I'm going to um, do one of my favorite, you know, Zentangle things, which is just these 
series of three lines. I wanted his nose to look a little darker. Could have used a different color pen too, but. So I hope everybody's having really nice weather. We've had some really nice weather, but then we've had some really um, <laughs> strange weather. Oh my goodness. So I want you to have great big teeth. And I want that to be a different color. And your eyes, I guess I want to color that in a little spot. out to use. This is that relief paste. Now if I can get it to work. Ooh, here it goes. Except my hand's so shaky that they aren't very straight. <laughs> He's going to need some whiskers, too. I'm going to just go I'm still in frame. I'm just going to go around his nose a little bit more. Okay, so I took a little bit of the paste and put around there. I don't want this line too dark. I mean, too heavy. Because... this on here. Um, I'm going to get his teeth a little whiter. So let me see what I have here. I have this pearl pen. Probably use that. Only thing is, is it's kind of puffy, you know. That's well, okay. I have this little like dentist tool <laughs> that I'm just scraping away some of the pearl paint. Kind of comes out blobby too. I want to leave the black lines. That's that is the challenge here. Well, that's like another texture there. I think I'll do that on his eyes too. Oops. There. That's good. Now, let's see. What else does he need? I think I want to use a little bit of, um, like, rub in here. Let's see. Any of these colors? This one might that silvery gold kind of thing, maybe, maybe this one. I, these are metallic, but I don't really know um, what they're called. 
metallic rub-ons. That's it. Silver's turning up gray. Mm, that's good. All right, he's pretty Eastery, isn't he? Can you see how the gold paint's kind of shiny on there? So it's pretty cute. All right, so that's my little Easter. Mixed media. I hope everyone has a wonderful Easter and a beautiful spring and that everything is going good with you. Everything is going really great with me. I'm taking a little bit more time to exercise and get out and enjoy weather, so that's why I haven't been on the web or doing many videos. All right. Have a great Easter. Bye. Beautiful. Look at that. Oh my god. Living on the river is wonderful. Where did they go? I don't feel like I'm zoomed in far enough. Look at your flying. Pelicans in Wisconsin. I think it's crazy, but it's beautiful.